Hi, Sherman Zoo.com here with Missouri offensive tackle Nate Crawford. Uh, Nate, your thoughts on today's first scrimmage? Well, um, I thought we had a good scrimmage as a team. Um, obviously, it's springtime and we're working to get better. And we, we we getting it and um, grinding out here as brothers and we we becoming one in this springtime. And uh, I thought we had a pretty good day today. All right, defensive line losing a couple future NFL players, uh, but this defensive line today. Just as strong, it looked like. Really, really strong guys. What, yeah. Talk about the defensive line that you're going up against. Well, they are. Um, all those guys that had experience, and um, they are. They are. It seems like they don't miss a beat. I, I know uh, those NFL guys made a big difference, but they're just as good. You know, learning behind those guys, we get that same stuff that they used to do. And uh, not only are they better, but they're making us better as an offensive line. Right. So you know the defensive line pretty well, since you are yeah. a former defensive tackle here yeah, at sir. Missouri. Describe your switch and what you've gone through to, uh, you, you're running the second team with the offensive tackle. Describe what you've gone through the transition from defensive line to offensive tackle here. Yeah, well, uh, I'm running with first and second right now. Mm -hmm. And um, it's, uh, man, the transition was kind of hard. You know, I'm not going to say a lot. I've never played offense before. And uh, making that switch, it was a lot to learn in a little bit of time. You know, this is only my second semester of doing this. And uh, my first spring doing it. Only went through camp. So um, from camp to now, I feel like I've gotten a lot better. And uh, the transition, like I said, was very hard. But we keep going day to day. Only That's the only thing I can do is take it day by day and keep on pushing and um, pray to God that, you know, I get the good out of it. Right, like you said, you're running first and second. Pretty good competition there with Clay Rhodes. Describe that uh, competition that you're doing right there. Well, um, that that really pushes both of us. You know, competition is great because uh, I know if I don't come out and do good, he's gonna he's gonna push away a little farther every time. So um, we try to we try to compete with each other. And on the field, you know, we we are both offensive tackles, so we're both on the same team. So it's no hard feelings. You know, we go in, we tell each other every day, hey, bro, let's get better today. Let the best man win. So if it uh, if it comes down to it, you know, we got great coaches and they'll pick the best one. The nice thing about the offensive line is you look like a, a pretty tight unit and everybody helps each other and helps pick each other up. Uh, playing next to, to Connor McGovern on, on the first team, that's got to help a lot too. Oh, man, yeah. It's, it's totally different once you go with the ones and the twos, you know, because Connor and Evan, they talk, they talk like me and you are talking right now. Mm -hmm. So I know exactly what's going on. So it's, it's no lack of communication between those two. And uh, with him, you know, he's letting you know you got to give him a yes. You know, he's a real senior on that offensive line. You, I mean, that, that offensive line, you got to give him a, a, a yeah or a no, no, let's do this. And he's going to correct you and let you know, hey, let's do this and let's do that. And it's great. I mean, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Right. Defense obviously ruled the day today. What does the offense have to do to get better? Some things out here today you saw that were good, but some things that you think need, you guys need to improve on. Well, you know, I, I really couldn't I really couldn't say what I seen because I wasn't I was basically focused on what I need to do, and you know, this is stream is about my technique and everything else. Mm -hmm. I couldn't be worried about everything else what's going on. Right. So what I seen from from me and my standpoint when I was in is a. Uh, that we have to we have to come together and actually play together and be more physical and, and dominate. Right. Yeah, that, I mean that defense is, is, is that they're exactly that they're physical and they're dominant. So you guys do got to go hard. Yeah. Every every play. Yes, How sir. about uh, your current height and weight? Uh, I'm six six four and a half six five at a three oh three oh five. And uh, what would your testing numbers? You remember this this spring? Your forty vertical, anything like that? Uh, I, run a, I run a five. 50940. Um, I can't remember the vert and everything else like that. Any PRs? Uh, weight room wise. Yeah. yeah. What were those? Uh, bench press 420, 425, I think. Uh, squat like 625, something like that. Okay. And your goals for the rest of the spring? To become, to get better every day. You know, I don't. I um, I, my goal is to win that starting spot, but also to get better every day and work on my technique and know that the uh, only thing I can do every day is get my best. Um, hopefully when the most improved comes spring. I think